in a desperate situation um, against a desperate team over there. It was a good hockey game, and uh, um, I think that goes down as probably one of our best games of the year. Uh, when you look at playing as a team, uh, the commitment level, the the, uh, the excitement, everyone trying to uh, to do more than than they're uh, supposed to, and that's uh, um, that's a good thing at this time of year. This may be a harder game to deal with on the second and back to back because of the speed that that they bring, and and it seemed like especially there in the third period, they're just kind of a a, a fairly steady barrage of, of shots in zone time. Yeah. Um, you know, I thought uh, the crucial part is we, for the first half of the, the, the third period, we um, kept the play pretty calm. Um, and uh, obviously they were going to make a push to their, their skill level and whatnot. And uh, like I said, um, the, the commitment level that we showed in, in that third period is uh, that's what's going to win you uh, playoff games. Um, so it's uh, I can't speak enough to, to not only the, the five guys that were on at the end, but uh, the whole whole game. Yeah, it was. Uh, it wasn't a real um, easy game. Warm building, cramping, and it was just. Uh, it was a relief to get it over with. The way we pulled it off, and uh, it was just uh, more than an exhale than anything. could do the splits like that. He's a man of many, many talents. So. Um, you know that's a that plays absolutely unreal, and uh, um, I mean I've played with him for a long time. I, I'm pretty used to him uh, uh, being extremely calm in those situations and pulling off the big plays. So um, it's not a surprise to me, but uh, uh, that was that was a great play. Have you changed the way you prepare for games here at all? Since that one episode here a couple of years ago, as far as the heat in the building and, and the yeah, um, this. Uh, I remembered that one, and I tried to get as much in me as I could today, but it was just uh, got to a point where you um, can't really do anything more. You just, you just sweat too much, and it's just a, a hot building um, at this time of year when it's uh, uh, temperature is getting hotter. So uh, it's, uh, it's probably worse tonight, so um, next time we're going to have to find a way to make it better. What's it say about you guys that you go out on a, a three-game road trip, play three games in four nights in these buildings against these teams, and come out with five out of six points? Yeah, um, you know the the biggest thing is uh, at times we know we didn't play our best hockey. Um, at times it was a little random the way the games were going, but but we found a way to to win or get points, and um, we had the consistent mindset when maybe our uh, you know our our play today was very very consistent throughout, but. Uh, the past two, maybe it wasn't, but our, our mindset was the same. It was uh, we believed in ourselves that we could, we could win a game no matter what the circumstances, and and uh, that's the big reason we got five out of six. How important was it to have the first period that you guys had, where you guys were the ones who were hard on pucks and winning the battles, kind of like Ottawa was early yesterday. Yeah, um, in this building, you know, they they come out pretty hard um, usually, and that that was a, a big emphasis, and I thought we did a good job of that. Um, Probably should have been more than one nothing after the first. I think uh, uh, Mrazek uh, stood on his head and, and kept them in it. So it was uh, um, a testament that we didn't uh, let, let him get in our head. We just kept pushing and, and kept sticking to our game. What happened there when Smitty needed to come out? Just cramping. Just uh, like I said earlier, just uh, it's not fun when that starts happening. But uh, it's why we got the best trainers in the world. You just stretch it out and you felt pretty good after that? Yeah, you just have to wait for it to release. Um, it's, it's happened to me plenty of times before, so um, I'm just glad we played a pretty, pretty strong third period and no, no power plays to uh, make it worse.